Uh, tell me how you got this head injury. I signed on for this job as a cameraman on December 10th. I reached out to the director. He was offering a cameraman position for his documentary. Do you remember his name? I think... I think his name was Jacob... Jacob Kraft. Anyone there? You must be the cameraman. Are you ready to head out? Are we good to go? I've got camera, tripod, extra batteries. Yeah, yeah, I think I trust you to have everything. I took the bus to his apartment complex about mid-afternoon. He greeted me there, and after we finished packing, we headed out to his car. He never actually told me what we were trying to film, but I just went along with it. Did he seem to know where he was going? Yeah, he set out immediately. The drive took a little longer than he said it would. I, I didn't really ask him about it, but by the time we got there, it was almost sunset. I was worried that we wouldn't have much time to film. So what's the plan exactly? Should I turn the camera on now? I think we could get some pretty good behind the scenes footage. Yes, yes, that's great. All right, I think we're good to go. Let's head out. Great. I thought you said this was only a mile away. Now it's getting dark. I miscalculated. We better hurry up. How much further on is this place? I thought you said it was a half mile. Don't worry. We're getting close. It'll be a surprise. Surprise? Well, I guess we'll see then. It's getting awfully dark, you know. Sunset is at 6 o'clock. 6? We'd better hurry then if we want to make it. I can't film in the dark. Oh, wait. I have a flashlight. I think we'll be okay. Be careful here. It's slippery. I still don't want to get it too dark, though. Wait, di did you hear that? You never know what you find in these woods. Pick up the pace. Alright. Uh, did you notice anything out of the ordinary as he was directing you? I, I heard this one noise. It really scared me. It was nothing I've ever heard before. But I, I knew I had to keep going because we didn't have much time left. I also realized we were lost, or I was lost. I was entirely relying on him to guide us back. Do you know how to get back to the trail? Yeah, I got it. I don't recognize any of this. I'm close now. I'm sure of it. It's just around the next bend. which made it a little more bearable, but it, it really seemed like something was out there with us. It 
This flashlight is barely doing anything. I think it must be nearly dead. Please, please don't get too far ahead of me. Mr. Kraft? Is this the spot? Are we almost there? This footage isn't much good, you know. Please just... Can, can you tell me if we're close? Did you hear that? It sounded like the thing earlier. Look, I really don't think this is safe. scratch marks on these trees. Really? Okay. Scratch marks. <sighs> I'm not seeing anything. Mr. Kraft, where are you? Mr. Kraft? Something's gone.
dearest friends, this industry has discouraged me for the longest time, deluded me, but I've found a better way. I have to stand out from the rest. I have to be above all these boring formulas. I hope you'll consider what I've been compiling for the last few years. I've got my methods. So, what does make for the most shocking documentary? I know a few things. Fear, trauma, death. Morbid curiosity is a powerful tool. <laughs>